Welcome to the Did You Know series. Today we'll talk about how to bind CRM data to an LWR site. Did you know that you can bind CRM data to your Experience Cloud LWR site so that it dynamically populates detail pages? Here's what you need. CRM data saved in object records in Salesforce, an LWR site with record detail pages, and components that use content binding. Let's see how it works. First, let's add record pages to your LWR site. When you create object pages, for example, let's create opportunity pages, Salesforce automatically creates three pages, a detail page, a list page, and a related list page. Let's give this page two columns. Then let's drag a component that uses data binding, such as the rich content editor, onto the page. In the properties, you can see that the component is already inheriting content from the opportunity. All you need to do is to connect the data fields that you want to showcase on the site. Let's bind and showcase one field using the property editor. Let's say, for example, you want to show the name of the opportunity here. And here we have the name of the opportunity. But what if you want to bind more than one field? Let's try to populate the name, description, and amount fields. In order to do this, we'll use expressions. When you click on the editor, you can use the expressions to populate these fields. For example, here we'll add the description and then the amount. You can customize these in any way, shape, or form. Let's add courier font. Note that you can only bind CRM data to that object's detail page, not on any generic page. After you've added all the CRM data components you want to bind, preview your site. Congrats! You've successfully bound the CRM data in your org to your LWR site. For more information, search data binding in the Salesforce help portal. Thank you.